the stream is live. It is live. Live and direct. We got some art code up in this business. Always put your powder in first. You hear me? What's up, what's up? I'm gonna take this chat out. Pop it out, baby, pop it out. Pop it out. <laughs> All right, let me move this over so I can read y'all's chat. Alabama in the house. What's up? What's up? Lisa is up in Perth. Well, morning. <laughs> what's up? What's up? Canada. What's up, Nancy from Canada? We got Clearscape Art from Sacramento. That's awesome. Hello, Sue, Ida. Eight thirty AM. Oh, that's not bad. It's a good start. Yeah, I like to start it off in a little black and white. So that uh um, it's just different, you know, starting it off in a little black and white. Be all right. Baby Fox is in San, San Sacramento. San Cremento. <laughs> All right. How's everybody doing tonight? Teresa, what's up? Joe from Florida. Vamp, what's happening? I hate this. It's, it's so funny like my facial hair it's like gray right here and then it's dark all right here and then under and then right here so it makes my cheeks look like they're drooping fat <laughs> I promise they're not I need to shave Christine from Florida as well Lisa says any single all right calm down Lisa <laughs> all right so we're gonna do um, something I've never done uh, I don't think I've ever seen the full movie I've probably watched kind of it a little bit what's the name babe the Sanderson sisters Sanderson sisters I'm gonna be doing, You're doing Winnie Winnie, Bette Midler, tonight. Can you guys hear me if I talk this way towards the computer? I'm sure it's better if I talk this way. Carrie Hicks, what's up? All right. Nancy Richards said, I am very happy to use resin art thanks to you. Oh, use the resin art. Well, you're welcome. Liz, here you go. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm going to be doing um, some uh, purples, some golds, and some greens tonight. I guess that's what her color was. So with that said, here we go. All right, so we got us a green base here. Oh yeah, and if you guys didn't see, um, let's put that on there. What is this? 
this is uh, this is all of them, huh? Lucy front, all of them. Let's add image, add existing all classes. Whoa. I'm gonna put this up so I can have it up. If you guys don't mind, I need to put these tour dates up. Um, Colorado is almost sold out. Um, but we need some seats filled in Arizona. So I'm gonna put this up here in the corner with you guys so that if people come in and they don't know about a class, there you go. Hopefully they can read that. Let me know how that looks. I'm going to fade that off up into there. Don's going to the Colorado class. I'm so excited about Colorado and Phoenix. Um, I've been to Phoenix probably about, I don't know, a couple years. Maybe it's been a good eight. Maybe eight or nine. Um, Colorado, it's been, God, probably 15 years. It's been a minute. My dad used to live in Colorado. Um, we did a class, uh, not a class, we did a, uh, a tour with uh, the Body Art Ball, Tawaka Body Art Ball, and we stopped in uh, um, Colorado a couple times. Always had a good time. I, I believe it was Denver. Um, like I said, my dad lived in Denver, so... All right, so I didn't want to mix purple and green, so I did the base green, so I thought that would be kind of fun. Um, I'm not going to use very much. We are using some stone coat, art coat tonight, which you can buy on our website at artistilldeath.com, um, or you can go to stone coat. Uh, countertops.com and get their they have all kinds of different kinds of resin they got countertop and quick set and vertical and all kinds of awesome stuff we're actually we're gonna be there in less than a week hello from Orlando what's up Judy Jenkins might have to start calling you just Miss Jenkins because we already got a Judy up in here and you don't want to be messing with Miss Judy. <laughs> All right, I'm only gonna make. I'm only gonna make enough for this. This is gonna be um, a pretty short video. So we'll just start out with four. See how that goes, because all we're do, what we're using is gold and purple. This is going to be kind of a short video because I have to work on a painting uh, for a friend of mine's daughter. Uh, I've been working on it for a while. Kind of uh, started it, didn't 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 really uh, like it. Pretty much in my head <laughs> a couple times, um, and uh, it's got to be finished by um, this weekend. So, and it's going to be. A Audrey Hepburn eating a donut and yes I'm recording it all right let's stir some resin up sorry if I miss anybody's question or comment or whatever um, Somebody in the room, if if, uh, if, I, if I miss it, somebody in the room will answer it. Especially the ones with the little wrench beside their name. We are very helpful here at ATD.
And I want to show you guys what I made earlier this week. Um, if you saw my Snapchat, you will uh, you'll know what I've been working on. It's kind of like a puzzle. Um, it's not. I don't want to make it a puzzle. I don't want to make it to where you have. I guess if you want to, you could, but um, you would really have to sand the edges down because this laser cuts so precise. Um, and then if you put resin over the top, you definitely are going to have to sand the edges down. But it's going to look like um, a stained glass piece that you can basically take the pieces out, stain them, or put uh, alcohol ink over them, whatever. Um, and then if you like, put resin over it. But like I said, you're going to have to sand those edges to put it back in the place. Um, and then I guess if you want, glue them in there or resin over it. I don't know. It would be up to you what you would want to do with it. I pictured it like a stained glass piece. So it would be like transparent stuff going over it. And then you can hang it in your window. Um, but I did take all the pieces out. And it looks really good just by itself, the, the whole uh, piece that, you know, what is that, what is that stuff called, the stained glass parts that connects everything? It looks fun just like that. <laughs> all right, I think we got this all mixed up. I only started with four ounces and if you just joined us we're using stone coat uh, art coat it's a one-to-one -one. it's an amazing art epoxy um, it gives you at least an hour and a half uh, working time we've used it two hours a good two hours um, depending on how hot it is or um, how humid it is in your studio um, it's got an awesome UV protectant in it. It's got up to 500 degrees Fahrenheit um, protectant. No odor. It's very nice. Very nice. Um, and it's a one-to-one. -one. And we sell it on our website, artistsilldeath.com. I know I'm like repeating myself here. All right. So. I think what I'll do, I think I'm going to put down a a base of clear first because I want it to kind of go over the top. I don't want it to stick to that. So I'm going to put some gold in my cup first. Whenever we use the powder, I always use the powder first and then put the resin in. And I like to overload this gold because I do. <laughs> Because when you put a powder in resin, it, it dilutes it. Then if you put it down on more resin, it'll dilute it even more. So and we're not going to be using a lot of gold. That's probably way too much. We're not going to be using a lot of purple because we don't want a lot of color on here. We want to be able to see this green. Hey, Sandy Sanders, what's up? Sue M. Doll, I'm at bingo watching you guys. <laughs> well, that's awesome. Good luck playing bingo. Tell all the ladies we said what's up in bingo land. What I'm doing, I'm just putting a layer of uh, resin down so that my other colors can go over it evenly and smoothly. And all I did was just spray paint this green. I think I used Montana something green. Nice little even coat. So this time last year was the first time we went to Australia 
You guys, how crazy is that? It's been a year. That's just bananas. So, um, I just thought of something too when I said that's bananas. Um, we've been asked back to the uh, Artisan Summit in Vegas with Stonecoat. And uh, we want to have some kind of um, achievement or something that we we want to give to uh, to people and so we came up with a poker chip some it, I guess it wouldn't be an award but kind of an award maybe a like I said an achievement or just something fun to have um, maybe to the point where we would have them um, you know every six months or whatever and you guys collect them if you're if you I don't know I don't know if it's an earn thing or a win thing or a we just want to give it out thing but it'll be most likely a poker chip in Vegas for the Artisan Summit I believe that's in April Vamp, you going to the summit, huh? You know you're going to be helping out. You know if you're a fan, you got to help out. <laughs> you got to check in with Clara because you know she's the uh, she's the queen um, ATD fam in Vegas. And see, I used, I think it's a gloss. I hope it doesn't really make a difference. Woo! Yeah, we'll be there for a week. All right, so. I don't know what I want to do. Like, her character, like the bottom. <gasps> Wait, there's red in that too, right? Or orange. Her hair's orange, right? You guys, I didn't make... <gasps> I do have some left. Is her hair orange or red? Yep, orange. Alright. Well, luckily I got some orange over here. Woo! I don't know what I was thinking. And I got just a little bit. And I'll... I only want to use a little bit because her hair is, uh, yeah, I didn't want to mix orange and green. That's why I did that. So we're going to use some of this saffron by Just Resin. It's a Just Resin kind of night. We'll use some of this. I think I'm going to put a little red in there too just to kind of brighten it up. Look at that saffron, you guys. You guys don't even know anything about that saffron. They're going to be writing about 10 murders. Okay. Mm -hmm. We're cooking tacos. I don't know if you guys know this, but it's International Taco Day. so. Also, I'm probably going to run the food processor in there. She's making salsa in there. Is JJ in the room? Is JJ going to go to Vegas? I'm going to put a little bit of this. Uh... No, I'm not. I'll just use the, the orange. Ooh, look at that.
That might be a little bright. I think I'm going to put a little bit of uh, stone coat black in there to make it sell up a little bit. Make it a little darker so it's not so... <gasps> That's going to be too much. Damn it. Yeah. I just meant that's a little bit too dark. <laughs> All right, let's try this. We're going to put a little bit in there. And then we'll add a little gold, a little orange. All right, that was definitely a mistake. I I didn't even like push on. I just tilted it. Dang it! I'm gonna have to make some more resin. I'm sure. It almost looks like a copper. All right. I'll just makes it just like. Let's here real quick. Oh, I just dropped my lid. And it went on the shelf. It rolled on my leg onto the shelf. Who in here is uh, going to the Artisan Summit? Did you guys already say? Two twenty then four. Oh, you guys talking sandpaper? Oh, baby cakes is asking a question. Yeah. Uh, use the two twenty first. And then the 400. Sorry, now everybody's saying that. <laughs> you start from the lowest, and you go to the highest. Uh, the lowest is rough, the highest is the smooth. So think about, you know, a, a 60 grit is like small rocks on a piece of paper, basically. <laughs> some more of that in there she just wants to use that thing that would be the food processor This would be a short video. I guess since her hair is like the main focus, we can make it the main focus that's a lot of resin for this little bitty piece I have to make some coasters with it then all right so I got it where I want it <laughs> now I'm put a drop of it in. The 
purple. All right, so I'm going to start with the purple down here. And then the orange is just going to kind of be like this. It'll be separate. I don't want to mix them all together. So it'll be kind of a literal interpretation, I guess you could say. need to get that foot pedal over here. <laughs> this was a horrible idea, you guys. I should have just done a <laughs> you need some white in there. <laughs> Sorry. I just tried to use it <clears throat> literally. And it's not it's not gonna work out like that. At all. Well, in your defense, I did give you this uphill battle of a <clears throat> challenge. Hey y'all. That's hot. Here's the water. Hey, no beans. DNA in those pieces. I can't believe she talked me into doing this. I didn't even like think about it. I just kind of, I feel like I'm first starting out. <laughs> Come on, you guys. You guys got me working with these colors here. Those weren't the best challenge colors. No, and it's just... It's terrible.
She set me up on this one, y'all. I don't know if we'll be able to save this one tonight, you guys. Super tilt. I don't even have any cups over here. Where are my cups at? Well, we show people a win, lose, and send drawses. Mmm. Do you have any white? <coughs> nope. Any clear left? I don't know. A little bit. I think you should do a torch and tilt with some white. Should be. Everything is up here except white. It shouldn't be. It's impossible. Here's white. I don't even have a rag up here. What is my deal? You guys, I wasn't supposed to be doing this right now. It's true. It's super true. You guys, what do we always do after we mix our paints? Put them up. This goes over everything, right? Right? This goes over, not under. You swipe. Hello? Oh, me? Sorry. What's up? You put this over. Yes. The colors. Over, then torch and tilt. Mm. Over, then torch and tilt. Over, then torch and tilt. Uh, mm. Get money. Mm. Mm. <laughs> My bolt's gonna take over. Babe, every time you say that, every time and every time I know. And every time it does. I know, babe, I know. Got me doing this. Uh uh. Yeah. Torch and tilt. I thought you were just going to torch it just down. I'm about ready to throw this through the window. <clears throat> just slide it towards you. And hit it right between the white and the purple. Too much white. Well, with these colors, I gotta put something in here because they just don't look good just hanging out like this.
talk about this. Did they get a Nobel Peace Prize or anything? They should have. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> that would be one way to do all three of them together. Mm hmm. It would be. Smells like Dodge City in this house right now. All right, there you go. Add a little white. Shows up a little bit more. It's fun. And I, I like it because the green's showing through, you know? So you got a little bit of everything in there. That white definitely did take over, didn't it? Gold, not so much. It's at the bottom. She got bingo. Did she really get bingo? He's a mighty mouse. <laughs> it's fun. See, I put that stone coat black in there. I put it in the purple and in the in the orange, so you can kind of see where there's cells at. I think it looks perfectly ghoulish. For the record, Billy's been in here laying with you this whole time. Mm -hmm. Right there. Alright, are you ready? But, Sue, did you call out bingo? There you have it. We got a 38 minute. <laughs> What's her name? Bingo. Guys, I can't wait. I can't wait to go to uh, to go see Stone Coat this week. We leave on Sunday. Um, I'm so hungry right now, and she made some tacos. Let me go eat some tacos, y'all. See, that's what you do. If, you, if you're wondering what I'm wiping off here, I'm just using alcohol to wipe off our sticks so we can reuse them. Always remember, wipe them off, put them to the side. Just use a little alcohol and you won't be throwing anything away. Huh? What? Davis' mom. You had an alarm set. Fred's mom. Fred's mom. Fred Davies' mom. Fred Davies' mom. I'll have to see it. All right. 
So there you go. What's this lady's name? <laughs> lady. The witch? Bette Midler. Well, I know Bette Midler. Her name in the movie. Is it Winifred? Winifred? What are you barking at me for, Beans? Clean those sticks. That's right. So... Um... What is this? Oh, that is it. Okay. Let's move this. We'll put up this Arizona class. And there's a Colorado class? What? On here? This is all of our info. I gotta move them around so they everybody can fit on the same page. Everybody's gotta everybody's gotta hang out. Why doesn't Colorado class when I show up? There it is. I guess I don't need to be seen, right? These are the classes. We're going to put these down here so you guys can see them. I hate grabbing the corners of these because it never works out. <coughs> so there you go. Um, thanks for showing up for this little, eh, what do you call it? <laughs> Live feed. Um, I guess I can move that up so you guys can kind of see me talking. I, I, I feel so weird not, there we go. Um. Thanks for showing up. You guys are awesome. Um, I'm I'm not good at these colors. I've never been good at colors. <laughs> so um, put the word out. We got uh, four seats available for Colorado and a couple for Phoenix. And we got a, a big response from Phoenix. So those people from Phoenix, get your seats in. Get your deposits in. It's only like 20. 25 bucks to put your deposit down come on maybe 50 75 sorry <laughs> um, so be sure and do that be sure to be kind to one another because you never know what somebody's going through um, you guys have an awesome Friday night international taco day we're gonna have some tacos tonight um, and that's about it and we'll see you guys tomorrow on the flip side, probably 8 o'clock ish, we'll say. Friday night. What do you think about that? What? You don't know what day it is? No. So, uh, I guess that's it. We will see you guys later. Have an awesome Thursday night. Bye. Say bye.